what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, my Marvelous. Call me my Marvelous. Call me Draymond, little brother. You can call me Bruh Man from Martin. I don't trip, man. You can call me whatever you want. You know what I'm saying? Or, you know, first things first, you know, I gotta let motherfuckers know I'm a diehard Laker fan. You know, I'm a diehard Laker fan. And as much as I want Anthony Davis on the squad, I do not believe in trading the whole damn team just to get one player. I'm of the belief if Anthony Davis really wants to come to L.A., he will come to L.A. If he really wants to be there, he'll be there. I'm not saying we can't trade for him, but the Lakers is prepared to offer five players, including all three young Bulls, plus three first-round draft picks. Nigga, what? Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you can put you can tell me all the numbers. I know Anthony Davis is 28 and 12, you know, 27 and 14. Whatever, whatever Anthony Davis is. Anthony Davis is a beast, he's a monster. He's basically, in my opinion, he's kinda like he's kinda like Kevin Garnett. He reminds me so much of KG. Maybe not as intense, but definitely the type of player KG was. But anyway, that's beside the point. The one thing I am glad about, I'm glad Boston ain't getting AD because they did my man IT dirty. And yeah, I'm a Laker fan, but you know, I shouldn't have anything to do with the damn Celtics, but I, I always loved Isaiah Thomas because he always proved people wrong. And then he goes to Boston. Boston was damn near irrelevant when Rondo, KG, and the crew left. So once Rondo was gone, Boston was pretty much a shithole. Well, not a shithole, but you don't. Basically, they weren't very good. Then they trade for Isaiah Thomas, and Isaiah Thomas makes a couple all-star teams, leads them to the playoffs, has, has an incredible MVP caliber year. And, yeah, he had an injury. And then they don't even call him and tell him he's traded. They don't, they don't tell him nothing, or they just let him go. And I'm sure that hurt him. And, you know, after all he's been through that season, I wouldn't have traded him that season. There's no way in hell I traded him that season, you know. But that's just me, you know. Danny Ainge is a different type of cat, you know. I don't want to argue with a motherfucker who got some championship rings. But at the end of the day, you know, karma's a bitch. That's what the fuck you get. You should have kept. You should have kept it on that team and kept on moving. And now you and now you trade him for Kyrie. Now Kyrie about to leave. And there's a chance that Kyrie might come and join LeBron in LA. It might happen. I doubt it, but it might happen. But this whole video is about Anthony Davis, so let me go back to that. And the Pelicans are trying to be stubborn with Anthony Davis. You stupid. You got this dude. He want to go. Trade him. Get the best offer for him. No, the Lakers are giving you five players and two picks. As much as I'm against LeBron and AD playing with the pips, I... Am shocked that New Orleans ain't take this damn offer. Dumbest motherfuckers in the world, New Orleans. If you don't take that offer, I mean, because you don't want to trade him to LA, maybe I understand. But at the end of the day, this is about your future too. But if I'm Anthony Davis, I try to go to Milwaukee first. If I'm AD, I try to go to Milwaukee, bro. Because him and Giannis will run through the East. I promise. Him and Giannis, that run. I promise. Him and Giannis run through the East. But I'm telling you, man, Anthony Davis, you are legit. The Lakers, I would love to have you here. But if you not going, but if we got to trade the whole team to get you, if we got to trade so many of our young pieces that I like, ain't even worth it, bro. Because guess what? We trade the whole team for you and LeBron. Guess what? We still getting smacked by the Warriors. Shit. The fuck? We still getting our ass beat. So what the fuck are you going to do? I'm just saying. You know, I'd rather build up these young boys and then have AD or somebody else come in as a free agent versus gutting my whole team and getting AD as a free agent and then playing with the pips. Not down with that shit, so. Tell me what y'all think in the comments. This is my first video. Like, subscribe. I appreciate it. Links to all my social media. And the person who did this fire-ass beat. 
in the comment section below. Peace.